How's it going everybody, Budget Pokemon here, and in this video I'm back with another Crown Zenith product, this time the Pikachu VMAX Special Collection. This released together with the with the mini tins. I'm planning to opening um, one of those in a shorts video, but without further ado, let me rip this open. So this is another product that has recently released, as I've just said. I think the next products that are about to release um, on what we call it 17th of March are the the normal um, what we call the normal tins, you know, featuring the Galarian birds, and that promo is horribly, horribly off-centered, which is kind of strange. Anyways, here is the the code card. If it would focus, can you focus? Maybe there you go. That took a bit longer. Then here are the promos, the Pikachu V. This is actually pretty cool. If it wasn't off center so badly. And then the Pikachu V Max. This is a promo in Japan from the Koro Koro um, comic. I actually have that one in Japanese. And what I really love is you get this jumbo card. As you know, I'm I'm really fond of these these jumbo cards. I like him. And you get five booster packs of Crown Zenith in total, which is really nice. I think the best pull from Crown Zenith I've had so far was actually the Melanie. Nothing else, not much to it. We've only got five booster packs here. Only five booster packs, but we're gonna make them count. So it started off with the first one. Actually, let me zoom in a bit so we don't have that much on the table here. Can show the cards a bit closer. And yeah, so what's after the, the tins? I think after the tins is the, um, the what we call it, the more Peko V Union playmat edition, which is also really cool. Like the playmat looks absolutely gorgeous. It features Marnie and more Peko. Here's a V Star marker. And then what else? I think the one that I'm really after is the. Or are the, the shiny collections, like the shiny Zashin and shiny Zamazenta. Um, ultra premium figure collection or premium figure collection, something like that. They feature, of course, some really cool, really cool figures. And of course, a lot of booster packs, which is what you're after, like a bunch, a bunch of them. Let's see. First pack, nothing, just a holographic Agron. Nothing, no goes for this one. Still got four more, though. So yeah, I do plan on opening, maybe not the tins, like the, the Galarian Burr tins. I might not do those, but I will definitely... Definitely open the the more Pico Union collection, like the um, the Playmat one, and for sure the the um, shiny Zamazenta and shiny Zashian box. Let's see energy right here, metal energy. And what else do we have here? Soul Rock, tracking shoes, Matang, got a Galarian Meowth, energy retrieval, Shinx, Larvista. Ponyard, got a Tangela, and we've got a Snorlax. So far, really, really tough with the poles, but it is what it is. Let's move it on to the third booster pack right here. Third booster pack is the charm, as they say. A third time's the charm. So see if this is this ends up being true. We've got a Punch Pancham right off the bat. We also have a code card right here. There you go. Something else to, to look out for is the the Triple Beat expansion, which releases on March 10th. I always thought it was March 1st for some reason, but no, it is March 10th that, that that one releases. So I'm excited to open that one. At the time of recording, I haven't got my my pre-order in, but I'm sure I, I will get it hopefully in time, but I don't mind waiting a bit longer because it tends to be pretty expensive. And just a Lycan Rock, damn. Dude, this, these other two packs better have something great, because we're getting kind of shafted here. Nothing really, not really much going on in this one. Not really much going on in this one. So yeah, um, next week will be a tier list video. You know, I'm ranking all the alternate arts. Similar to what I did with all the character secret rares for VMAX Climax. You know, the Sword and Shield era is coming to a close. So... I do want to make sure that I cover everything I want to talk about. And we'll see. We will see. Friends in Hizui, Whalemur. Got a Pokeball. Got a really happy Corfish. I really like this illustration. Got an Oddish, also very happy. A Seal. 
We've got, yo, nice, we've got something here. We've got a Poochiana. And we've got a Waylord. Hey, at least we've got something. At least we got a singular pull, the Poochiana. Pretty sure I've pulled this before. I think I pulled this before, but this is still really cute. Last Pack Magic, a really short video looking on, on at the recording time, but oh well, it is what it is after all. There you go, there's the code card. Let's just do, do it like this. We have the energy. And let's see what we can find in this last pack. Rescue Carrier. Got a Salazzle. Got a Carvanine. Got a Whalemur. Got a Pokeball. A Corfish. An Oddish. We've got a Seal once again. We've got, yo, we've got a Suicune V! Holy moly, this is insane! We did get something in the last set and in the last pack and a Rotom V-Star to top it off. Yo, this is actually, this might actually be one of my favorites from Crown Zenith. I, I pulled this in, in Japanese as well. Go check out um, one of the videos, I'll leave it down below. But this is, this is really nice. This is such a cool illustration. And I now have it same with the Melanie. I now have this one in Japanese and in English. So this is really, really nice. Well, the last few packs ended up ended up pulling through. We've got some really nice pulls right here. But that does it about for this video. Really short video, but, you know, it is what it is. If you did enjoy this video, then please give it a like. If you didn't enjoy it, give it a dislike. Tell me in the comments below what you didn't like. So I can try to fix that for future videos. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. Peace, peace.